without paperwork is good. Clearly not too much power underneath Kamala's hood. Borders are. What is up, guys? Tyson Dela Cruz here. Thank you so much for rocking with me. Mr. Reagan does it again. He drops another parody ad. This is a Kamala Harris parody ad. This is Kamala Harris parody ad number five. He has been on a streak lately with all of the ads. If you haven't seen the previous ads, I will we'll place those in the description below so you can watch each of them and react to each of them. Shout out to everybody watching. Drop your comments down below. Smash the like button, share, subscribe, and let's get into the Kamala Harris Parody ad by Mr. Reagan, number five. When Joe and I opened the border, flooding America with tens of millions of illegal aliens, we thought voters would think we were kind and generous. <laughs> you serious? But it turns out Trump was right. They're not sending their best. They're not sending their best. It turns out that they are, in fact, bringing drugs, bringing crime, bringing their fists, and apparently they're eating the cats. Eat the cat. Eat the cat. But when I'm president, things will be different. I'm like an abusive boyfriend who promises to stop beating up his girlfriend if she agrees to marry him. If you elect me president, I promise to stop destroying the country. I know I've been bad, but trust me, baby, I can change. My plan to stop illegal immigration is simple. I'm going to fly all the homeless people from every third world country on the planet into our country. Every lunatic from every asylum, every murderer, rapist, and violent criminal. About 712 million people. Once all 712 million are here in the U.S. Problem solved. You can't illegally immigrate if you're already here. Even Republicans have to admit that's good logic. This election is about looking forward. America is like the Titanic, and I think it's about time we had a woman manning the wheel. We are not going back. <laughs> Mr. Reagan. <laughs> These are so good. Mr. Reagan is trolling them with these Kamala Harris ads. What did you guys think about that? Drop it in the chat down below. Let me know what you thought about this ad. I thought this one was top notch. And uh, I'm going to share another one that I thought was great. The original one is the best, but I think this one is a close runner up. This most recent one and this one, I think it's a tie. Let me share it with you. The economy is failing. And if I'm elected to four more years, things are only gonna get worse. And so I, Kamala Harris, want to encourage every little girl in America to follow the same career path as me. Prostitution. When I was a prosecutor back in San Francisco, I was an ambitious young woman. If I thought a man could help me with my career, you'd better believe I was hooking up with him. Oh yeah. <laughs> Finally, I met the ultimate sugar daddy, San Francisco Mayor Willie Brown. Willie Brown, who once dated Harris, says he's excited a black woman is on a presidential ticket. It was wonderful to have that kind of ongoing daily activity relationship. Now Brown is widely credited with helping to launch the senator's career. Willie was married at the time, and so I was what's called a mistress. As Willie Brown's mistress, I was given lucrative positions in California state government. These were essentially fake jobs, stealing from California taxpayers. For one job, I met just two days per month and was paid about $250,000 per year. And so when Donald Trump asks how I'm going to deal with Vladimir Putin or Kim Jong-un, well, let's just say I got a lot of experience dealing with powerful men. Some politicians do backroom deals. I do back rub deals. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Mr. Reagan. I'm Professor Sun and Beesmans, and I approve this message. Team Trump. <laughs> Classic. Classic. Shout out to Mr. Reagan and Elon for retweeting the first ad. And we can't, we got to say uh, a shout out to Professor Sug on these nuts. He is the official spokesperson and representative for all parodies across the United States and the intro web. Gavin Newsom, suck it. Let me know what you guys think about these parody ads. Drop your comments down below, smash a like button, share, subscribe. And as always, I'll catch you on the next one.